Shalom, Shalom. Um, this is Psalms. It's 104. Um, sorry, verse 3. Who layeth the beams of his chambers in the waters, who maketh the clouds his chariot, who walketh upon the wings of the wind, who maketh his angels spirits, his ministers a flaming fire. And give all praise to our power, Yahweh. Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shah, Bahashem, Rakakutash. On double honors to the elders and apostles, great millstones, do well. Peace, bless the hopeful let Shalom, Shalom. Um, so, um, the reason why I brought out that scripture, um, because this, I'm gonna label this title, um, most likely probably, um, Chariot or, um, Clouds, question mark, or maybe something in that type. Um, because, when I went back over my video, my street teaching on um, um, over the weekend on Sunday, um, I noticed that these these clouds, man, were doing some strange things, man. So, you know, what I'm saying, I believe, you know, what I'm saying that they're, they're chariots, man. That they was the chariots, man. You know, what I'm saying, and they had their eyes upon this kingdom, man, upon this sinful kingdom, man, upon. Two thirds of our people, man, upon the righteous and upon the wicked, man. They're they're watching the eyes of the Lord upon the wicked and the righteous, man. You know what I'm saying? That's why I believe what's what's going on, man. In my video with these clouds, man, that, that I'm gonna show you in in the background. It's gonna be at the um. It's gonna start at the top, the top um, top hand of like right above my, my my skull, right up. If you look, then you'll start seeing these clouds like um do weird things, man, like dissipate away, you know what I'm saying, but it's other clouds that haven't dissipated away, you know, so you'll start to see the clouds dissipate away, and then you're going to see, um, do more, more show, man, which I believe it was just chariots, man, you know, um, the scriptures say the chariots are camping around those who fear the Lord, you know what I'm saying, so, the angels of the Lord are camping around those who fear the Lord, so like it. so, um, furthermore, I'm, I'm going to let this video play, and y'all let me know what y'all think this is, um, Chariot or just clouds, you know what I'm saying, or um, uh, apparition, um, strange apparitions from the Lord, you know. So, bear with me, Papa Kachai. Hashem in the name Yahweh Shai, which is the only begotten Son, man. And Yahweh means He is, He exists, He is to be, man. So, 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 how much more? How much more are you gonna still see? You know what I'm saying? The man out here on the highways and byways. They, I seen an article that said um, that loud speaking carries the coronavirus. What type of bugged out stuff is that? <laughs> so you telling me if if you and your significant other get to argue and you can't yell because it's going to pass the coronavirus, that's what you're telling me? <laughs> that's some bugged out opinion. That's some vague stuff, man. That's vain, man. That's the opinion of a man. That's doctrines of men. Telling you something. And then, like I said, two-thirds of our people are going to follow it. They're going to follow it to the grave, man, because they believe that to be true when it's wickedness. So, like I said, they say, oh, what's the, what's the saying? You believe a lie quicker than you believe the truth? That's what's going on, man. Man, the, the covenant, Esau, Edom covenant is getting pulled up, man. That, that bare leg is showing, man. You know what I'm saying? If, if you don't consider this dude the son of the devil, man, then what? So, Slanky Israel, um, as you see, look at the top of my head, you'll start seeing these. These weird little um, shapes start to come down, um, it look like clouds, man. So, so, so bear with me, Papa Kasha. You can see man. <laughs> All right. Um, John 10, 27. My sheep hear my voice, and I know them. Man, smart, Let me, let me get a voice up. <laughs> to, to back up, um, John 10 and 25. Let's go to John 17 and verse 9. Because this is the proof that, you know what I'm saying, the Lord only came for the sheep. That he only sent the men out there on the highway and byways for the sheep. The lost sheep of the house of Israel, man. You saw how Negro, Latinos, Hispanics, Native Americans, Semio Indians, man. The ones who got butchered, raped, robbed, and murdered, man. The ones that the scripture said that went into captivity, man. Under, under, under the Hamites, under the Babylonians, man. Under Assyrians, man. So you see that, Israel? You see that? Um. They're dissipating away, man. Doing chariots, man. Call her lion, love you. How about shim? You how shy about shim? Um, cause the chariots, man, I got they got they got their eyes on us, man. They got their eyes on the righteous and the wicked, man. You know, um, Amos.
Amos 9. Um, verse 8. Behold, the eyes of the Lord Yahweh are upon the sinful kingdom, and I will destroy it from all the face of the earth, um, saving that I will not utterly destroy the house of Jacob, said the Lord. So the Lord said he's going to destroy Babylon, man. He's going to destroy this sinful kingdom, man. You know what I'm saying? And, and right along with it, these heathens and two-thirds of our people that's wrapped up in this sinful kingdom will be destroyed too, man. So, so kind. Kind is because we know that the Lord has his angels out watching all, all this craziness that's going on on earth. Let's get a precept. Let's go to the book of Proverbs. And verse 3 um, The eyes of the Lord are in every place Beholding the evil and the good So the eyes of the Lord are in every place man Beholding the evil and the good man And as I say in my spirit I believe you know what I'm saying That these are the chariots Because they dissipate away man they, they was doing Or these could be some strange operations from the Lord man And you know, so he's showing these signs man These prophecies are jumping off the pages man so, slunk Israel. I'm going to keep going. Just keep watching, Israel. And as those dissipate, start looking at um, the left side of the screen. Um, you start seeing more of it. More of it. They start doing more things, man. And you, you just start noticing all types of strange things in the background of the sky or the heavens. Also, this is John uh, 17 and verse 9. I pray for them. I pray not for the world, but for them which thou hast given me, for they are thine. And all mine are thine, and thine are mine, and I am glorified in them. So, so we glor who we glorify? Yahweh Bashem, Yahweh Shah, man. We don't glorify ourselves. If you, if you see men glorifying themselves, they're not of the sheepfold, man. They're not trying to be a part of the sheepfold. They're not showing their repentance, man, showing their diligence, man. They're just trying to be of their own vague stuff, man. Their own loopy filters, lucrative, slug you. Their own filthy lucrative, man. They're not in this thing. They, 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 how they say, you ain't in this thing to win it, man. They, they ain't in this thing for a crown or to be part of the kingdom. You know what I'm saying? Shoot, I'd rather be made with no legs and stuff in the kingdom, man. I'm still in the kingdom, man. You know, shoot, shoot, what you mean? <laughs> you call know, this a kingdom inside? Tell us something. Oh, I'm getting a mansion or whatever. You got a, a fresh house. You know what I'm saying? Got a bunch of clothes in there. You call it a kingdom? Man, we in captivity on this side, man. You know what I'm saying? You, you, you still, you still got to work to death, man. What you talking about? You work it to death. You work it till your body is beat down over here in Babylon. Y'all talking about this is, man, I got to be content with this. No, man, you be content with what the Lord what you be content with, man, while you're here. But, man, you supposed to be pushing for that, to be part of that kingdom, man. You know what I'm saying? Do the mind the same the Lord said, um, uh, uh, for we are, uh, he wanted us to be holy people. We are holy people, peculiar people, man. His secular, man. His treasure, man. You know, so, so how much more, Israel? Oh, uh, slunk you. Alright. Um, this is John 10 and 26. But ye believe me not, because ye are not of my sheep. And I said unto you, my sheep hear my voice, and I know them, and they follow me. So they follow Yahweh Shah with that way he go, man. The sheep follow the prophets, man. The sheep heard the words of the Lord, man. And they follow the, 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 man, the man of the Lord that were pushing it, man. In righteousness, man. Not in no weakness, man. Salam like y'all. Uh, so Salam like y'all. I ain't want to keep that going too long, but um, I'm going to have to go back through it again. Um, but if I'm not mistaken, that it, it's more, some more strange things happen, happen in that video, man. I just had to go over again. But y'all seen what happened at the top of my head, yeah, man. All that weird dissipation going on. It showed itself in the dissipate. But it showed clouds already. It's right there, man. So y'all let me know what y'all think is this. In my spirit, I believe it was the chariots, man. It was the eyes of the Lord, man. Um, let's go to um, Psalms 34.
Psalms 34, um, start 15. The eyes of the Lord are upon the righteous, and his ears are open unto their cry. The face of the Lord is against them that do evil, to cut off the remembrance of them from the earth. Um, The righteous cry, and the Lord heareth and delivereth them out of all their troubles. The Lord is nigh unto them that are of broken heart, and save such as be of a contrite spirit. Many are the afflictions of the righteous, but the Lord delivereth him out of them all. And these are our deliverance, man. The chariots that we see, man, are, are a sign that, that, you know what I'm saying, that we should have hope that we'd be able to get beamed up and transformed, man. Getting the new bodies, man. I had to go to the New Testament. Pick it up on um, First Peter. First Peter three and twelve. For the eyes of the Lord are over the righteous, and his ears are open unto their prayers, but the face of the Lord is against them that do evil. Or is upon them that do evil, man. So the Lord is watching the righteous and the good. I mean, it's like it. The righteous and the evil, man. Um, so if you're doing wickedness, man, the angels are appointed to the Lord. If you're doing righteousness, the angels are appointed to the Lord, man. You know what I'm saying? They've seen it all, man. They've reported it back to them, man. Let's go to the Old Testament. Um, let's go to Second Chronicles. For the eyes of the Lord run to and fro throughout the whole earth to show himself strong in the behalf of them whose heart is um, for fight towards him. Herein thou hast done foolishly, therefore from henceforth thou shalt have wars. So, man, doom, 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 trades are, are weapons of, of, are, are weapons of war, man. You know what I'm saying? Much, much stronger and much more, you know what I'm saying? Upgraded than nuclear weapons, man, atomic bombs and stuff, man. They're, they're the Lord's, you know what I'm saying? Little miniature weapons, man. His, his weapons that he got out here. And he got thousands of them, man. You know? This thousand, thousands of chariots of the Lord's, man. Of the Lord's, like it. Let's stay in the Old Testament. Let's get on um, Job. Go to the book of Job. His eyes are upon the ways of man, and he seeth all his goings. There is no darkness nor shadow of death where the workers of iniquity may hide themselves, for he will not lay upon man more than right that he should enter into judgment with Yahweh. So, man, you, you wicked people ain't hiding anything from the Lord, man. And nobody, you know, if you're doing wickedness, the angels see it and they report it. Doing righteousness, the angels see it and they report it, man. And like I said, if y'all let me know what y'all believe this to be, man. I believe it to be the, the chariots of the Lord, man, or a strange operation. That's probably what I'm labeling. Strange operation or chariots of the Lord, man. Uh, so it's like, yeah. Let's go to the book of Proverbs. Proverbs 5. Five and twenty-one. For the ways of man are before the eyes of the Lord, and He pondereth all His goings. So, Lord, the Lord basically keeping His eye on us through His angels, man. You know what I'm saying? Let's go to Job um, thirty-one. Job 31 and um, 
Joe 31, man. I'm start at verse 3. Is it is not destruction to the wicked? Question mark. And a strange punishment to the workers of iniquity? Question mark. Do not he see my ways and count all my steps? So the Lord sees he our ways and he count all our steps, man. He see everything, man. So come on, let's go to Jeremiah 16. Um, Jeremiah 16 and 17. Um, for mine eyes are upon all their ways. They are not hid from my face. Neither is there iniquity hid from my eyes. So ain't nothing hidden from the Lord, man. Um, the Lord got his angels out of report and everything. 24-7. Seven, seven days a week. 365. You know what I'm saying? Alright, um, so come on. I got one more. And I hope this is edifying. Y'all let me know in the comment board what y'all think this is. Because um, I think it's the chariots of the Lord. If y'all think it's something else, put a scripture up and edify me with your own scripture. On what y'all think it is or scriptures that talk about strange y'all. Or anything. Just if y'all think, you know what I'm saying, y'all have an idea what this is. Let's go to um, Psalm 33. And I'm going to close out. Behold, the eye of the Lord is upon them that fear him, upon them that hope is in his mercy, to deliver their soul from death and to keep them alive in famine. Our soul waited for the Lord, and he is our help and our shield. So, so there you go, man. Yo, so the Lord is going to be here with, with the name of the Lord to deliver them from um, famine and, um, and um, death, man, and them chariots, man. See, the chariots are, are the angels, man. They're watching, reporting everything. So remember that, Israel. And with that, I'll do that. If I'm going to close out, I'll turn our praise on the glory is due to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shah, Bahashem, Rakar Kadash. Double honor to the elders and apostles of the great most on Stay well. Peace and blessings to the whole full Shalom, shalom.